Hey fire signs, welcome back to Pure Black Magic. Emphasis on the pure, the black, and the magic. If you're new here, welcome. My name is D. Thank you guys for taking the time to check out the channel. Hopefully you find clarity through this message. You like the vibe here, the energy, and decide to hit that subscribe button. If you are returning, super, super thank you for all of your continued love and support of the channel, you guys. It is always greatly appreciated. Um, a fire sign. So I keep seeing, well, first of all, I saw the transformation card, which has a butterfly on it. Um, but I keep seeing all of these like cards with butterflies or like, um, like rainbows, butterflies, almost like magic. It's a unicorn here. Um, transformation. This is the card that I keep seeing. So a butterfly could be significant. Okay. Something about butter butterflies could be significant. Scorpio could be significant with this transformation card as well. Um, but this is your weekly energy update. So anywhere from the, um, 20th of February through the 26th, give or take a couple of days, very general message, you guys. So keep that in mind. It might not entirely resonate. Um, just take what does, leave what does not for the next person. Okay. So the first song I got for you guys, um, so the intuitive message I'm getting is you have no idea. Okay, so because we're seeing this transformation energy, it could be you have no idea like what's about to take place. Like you couldn't imagine what's about to happen this week or like what you're about to hear or come across. Um, but I'm getting you think you know, but you have no idea or there's something like you are going to be like your response to it is, is going to be like, I had no idea or I just you're completely shook or shocked or taken back like you had no idea. So maybe somebody is telling you something. You're finding out something here. Um, but the first song I got for you guys is Essence by WizKid. Um, and it was actually giving me vacay vibes, vacation vibes. Um, it was giving me like a high, like some sort of like a natural high or maybe an actual high. So some of you guys could like be smoking. Maybe you're smokers here or you're trying it out for the first time. Um, but essence, it's like something is, it's also y'all's vibe this week is giving me the energy of like something isn't necessarily what it seems to be. So this could be a relationship. Maybe you're finding out about like a friend's relationship um, or something just kind of like, maybe you, um, you held something or someone to a high standard or put them on a pedestal. Um, and it's just not that, okay. Or you are presenting yourself to be something that you're not, or someone else is presenting themselves to be something that they're not. Something appeared to be like a lot of, have a lot of essence. Um, but the next song is No Idea by Don Tolliver. I think is how you say his name. Um, so again, it's like something has all of this essence. It feels good. It feels like a natural high. It almost feels like an illusion. It's flowy. Like it's just this goodness. And then the no idea song comes on and he's talking about like, he had no idea. Some girl he was talking to was so in love. Like she had a whole relationship. Um, she was so in love, but she at the same time was messing with him. And I guess he found out and just had no idea that she was so committed and so in love because of the way she, you know, was pursuing him or acting towards him. So I don't know. It's really weird. If this is not your energy that you're hearing about something like this happening this week. Okay. This community card, this is the rainbows and the butterflies I'm talking about. Um, but I don't know. It also could be like you just, you don't or you didn't expect something to go so exceptionally well. It's like maybe you're expecting a worse in a situation this week, fire signs, or just not really expecting it to give whatever is giving. Okay, so something or someone could be giving more to you. Maybe this is more money, like a more a bigger deposit than you were expecting or a relationship that's more fulfilling or opportunity. Something is just giving more, okay, that you just maybe you count it out or you just didn't expect it. So let's see what's going on. Like the video if you haven't already, you guys comment. I comment back all that good stuff. So your energy is put into these messages. So we have wisdom. So you are gaining clarity here, okay, or becoming more wise in the situation. Um, a water sign could be significant because it's water here. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio um, is sticking out. We have new beginnings, okay, wisdom, new beginnings, and we have... Something about this new beginning is messy because I'm just not realizing that I got like coffee or something on this new beginnings card. Um, it's something about this new beginnings that's messy, okay, or it's unclear or it was tough for you to get to this point. Like it wasn't easy. 
okay whatever's happening this week and you have this damn community card this is like the third or fourth time i just said these rainbows and these butterflies here um i'm also getting the vibe of like a beautiful disaster okay or something that's like it's beautiful even though it's tainted okay or maybe other people feel like it's tainted or it's messy somebody is also viewing you as just being beautiful even with like no hair, no, not, not no hair, but no makeup. Maybe your hair is not done or it's not cut or you don't feel like you look your best self. It's something about you still being a prize or still being beautiful or something, a situation, something here is still of good value. Um, even though it's been through the ringer here. I don't know. It's crazy. Um, but it's crazy abundance that's showing up. It's abundant. So I don't know. Y'all got to let me know how this is resonating for you in the comment section below. We're going to put these cards back and move on to the energy deck. If it is hitting home for you and you want to book a private reading, check out the description box below in regards to how to um, book a private session with me. So at the bottom, you do have man holding a heart. Okay. And we have garden in the gate here. Okay. We also have cornucopia. This could be cornucopia and attachment. It's this you could be holding back okay from some sort of offer or a person okay this is fire sign energy for me aries leo sagittarius picking up on a lot of aries but any fire sign um or just it's almost like you're holding back right guarding a gate or you're not expecting much from a situation something is giving more like he ripped his heart out and it's in his hand so whether this is love or not whatever situation this is for you it's giving more than what you think you thought like maybe you're hesitant you're not fully open to it and you don't know but it turns out to be a good experience okay a good something whatever this is because you have cornucopia you also have attachment and you have happy family so even though there's um so res some like reservations like you're you have these reservations about something um or like a hesitancy i feel like it's coming through for you guys okay 888 could be significant for you oh this devil this deceit card um i think i pick up on this a lot for you fire signs half of the time it's it's people like deceiving you and being envious towards you but the other half of the time honestly is you deceiving yourself or some sort of self-sabotage or doubting something but we oh we got the deceit card with the envy card back to back fell out here then we have yin and yang and we have all tied up okay so there is some sort of balance that's coming whether someone tried to deceive you or this is you not being able to see the the victory in something okay the success in something it's balancing out or it's coming to light it's no longer going to be an issue here but i do see y'all holding back being scared or hesitant okay something about smoke is significant smoke smoking is very significant um maybe mirror magic okay incense smoke any some type of smoke is significant here all right so let's see spirit messages for my uh fire sign somebody can go by the name of smoke also okay um maybe find out somebody smokes i don't know what's going on with smoke in y'all's reading Messages for the fire signs this week, spirit. Most important messages. What's going on with the energy that's coming towards them? Okay, so we got broken heart. I'm also hearing I don't want any smoke. Or are you telling somebody like they don't want any smoke with you? So this can be some sort of some sort of conflict going on here. But we got the broken heart. We have the first chakra all right something here too it's like bef the first chakra is the base chakra so something could be off to a false start here or something can't even really get off the ground without you assuming it's not gonna work out okay or this is someone else in regards to you but we have your crown chakra in the middle okay then we have temple path okay and then we have the world card so if this is you i feel like you're coming out of this energy or it's something about, it's like your focus is on, somebody here is focused on the wrong thing or, hmm, let's see. Angel of love with a broken heart though. Yeah, so it's like, you think you know, but you have no idea. It's something that you just wouldn't expect. Like you expect to lose you expect somebody to let you down or to be disappointed. However it is, it's like you're expecting the worst. But in comes the angel of love here. Okay? Or you're, you're doubting yourself. It's like you aren't... You're doubting yourself in some sort of way. But love is here. Support is here. 
cornucopia again happiness is here abundance is here with this first chakra like there somebody has a strong desire for you and to make you happy healing all of that and i don't know maybe you're just having a hard time being accepting of it or this opportunity okay or being being accepting of yourself this could just be in regards to yourself you're having a hard time like fully being you or fully being open. It's something about somebody being open with their sexuality too, like the energy of someone coming out the closet. So maybe that's very shocking here or some sort of secret, some sort of hidden knowledge, especially with this, um, this crown chakra. It's like you are hesitant to make something known or you're holding a secret that you just want to get out to somebody fire signs or you just need to tell someone or some sort of like hidden secret information is showing up here adjacent possibilities with the temple path you're trying to figure out how to move forward in a situation how to reveal this how to speak your truth how to fully live in your truth here or how to move on okay and then we have the contract card with the world card here so yeah transformation the butterflies i feel like something is gonna work out for the best i don't know if you're worried about it or someone else is worried about it here could be worried about a contract or picking something or someone making the right choice here you could just be wondering if this if this is where you are truly meant to be am i on the right path a lot of reflecting okay at the bottom of the deck we have the community card um i think the air signs i think this community card popped up in all of the elements to be honest so it might be a um collective type of energy but it's something like you are it you have it you're good enough you have the talent the potential okay you're the apple of someone's eye whatever it is you're strongly doubting or thinking the worst about it's not that it's the exact opposite like you think you know but you have no idea that's it's the same message all right so let's see magician financial uh constraints so the magician is a manifester it's making stuff happen it's action bringing stuff into reality right financial constraints is some sort of lack here loss or something something's being balanced out with this hot and cold energy okay this ice and fire energy could be a water sign and a fire sign but also from nothing to something here okay from rags to riches here all right with this financial constraints and then the magician card and then then a community and it's all about you it's something about from rags to riches here so it's it's a come up in some sort of way okay um but it's something about you doubting it or doubting yourself or maybe this is other people who have doubted you okay um and you just really you know showing out or just you know proving yourself without really having to prove yourself all right death card at the bottom of the deck transformation it's huge transformation all over y'all's energy and what's transforming what's coming in is the three of cups it's gonna make you very happy like something here is really working out in your favor although you just would not expect it okay so maybe you have no idea what the hell i'm talking about right now and at some point during this week you're gonna find out okay cancer could be significant a gemini could be significant the empress card wow the devil okay somebody somebody is like so attracted to you like it's just you okay um or thinking about you obsessing over you or wanting this new beginning with you but this could also be you holding back and obsessing it's something about you being the perfect you being beautiful handsome like you being it but you overthinking it okay um it's something about doubting yourself showing up here so or just trying to strategically plan something fire signs okay so let's see nine of cups yeah you want this wish fulfillment but it's just like it's giving like a side eye energy i don't know three of cups two of pentacles yeah you got the three of cups but you're still trying to figure out if it's really the three of cups all right eight of wands Ten of wands. A lot of y'all are making something much harder for yourself than it has to be. World card. Okay. Or you feel like somebody else is doing so. Spirit with messages. Okay. World card. Uh, high priestess energy. Hmm. What messages do we have for the spirit is guiding you towards whatever this is or trying to get you to see something here? Look at the six of swords. Okay. We also have the three of swords at the bottom. The eight of cups. The Three of Pentacles, the King of Cups, the Five of Cups, the Six of Cups. For some of y'all, it's Spirit is trying to get you to see some situation here. Um, maybe you're finding out 
like why a situation ended okay or spirit is trying to get you to see that a situation is 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 something more to a particular situation i don't know if, if someone has been acting funny or acting a certain type of way it's something more to it so whatever it is you think is going on with a person or a situation it's not that it's not that it's something else something else is deeper is going on here magician and the damn fucking transformation card again look at this something here and the empress again with the ace of pentacles Y'all, some of y'all are doing some heavy manifesting here. Like, y'all are calling something in. I don't know if you're actually doing some sort of, like, ritual work, manifestation work, or magic. Um, but whatever it is that you're doing, it's like, it's almost like it's warming up, okay? Something is well worth it here. Um, something about, like, a huge return, okay? So, if you're making some sort of investment and you didn't think it would return much or you just didn't think the most out of some sort of partnership or deal or whatever it is, it's like, it's coming in, it's coming in strong and it's coming in, like, in, in an abundance here. The Magician, again, with the Six of Pentacles, money. Y'all, manif you're manifesting, like, a partnership or some sort of money here. It's, um, it's um, the energy of things just being very lucrative, all right? So, let's see. What's going on with my fire signs this week, spirits? You think you know, but you have no idea. We have the Two of Wands, and then here comes the Justice. Here's you trying to figure it out. Oh, I'm not sure, stuck, or something like that, not taking action, lacking balance, and here comes the balance. Okay, a Libra could be significant. We have the Moon card here. Okay, we have the Five of Pentacles, and we have the Star card. We got the Moon and the Star. See if the Sun comes out. That's your energy, Leo. You don't see this coming. The moon card is a lack of clarity. I feel you don't see this coming. I don't know what it is. Maybe a Libra is communicating some, something to you. Maybe this is a court situation. This is some sort of karmic justice balance like in your favor that's going on. And I feel like you are, are tied up looking elsewhere. And something so totally unexpected is coming in. Five of Pentacles. And it's jumping from the Five of Pentacles to the Star card. So it's going from lack you know, lack mentality or feeling abandoned, just low vibrational money problems to a divine wish being granted, to healing, to a gift being given to you. An Aquarius could be significant. I just said, let's see, you got the moon and the star. Let's see if the sun comes out. Okay, the sun. Actually, last week, was it y'all weekly's reading? The message was the sun will come out tomorrow. So, if you haven't seen that, go watch it. Okay, let me know if that resonated for you now that the week has kind of passed, the energy has passed. I felt it. And y'all had the sun, the star, and the moon last week or some prior week. Like, y'all have been having everything. Okay, or this big... It, it's, it feels like something's been leading up to some sort of big reveal or big something, big transformation in your life. Okay, and maybe you've lost hope on it because it's taking too long. Or uh, for a lot of y'all, this is totally unexpected. Like some sort of blessing is coming in. Like you, again, you don't know what the hell I'm talking about, but you will. You will. You're going to find out. I just, I just spoke it up. The sun will come out tomorrow. Go check that reading out. Um, but with the two of wands, this is some sort of clarity here. Okay, so no longer being stuck, being able to see the way. Six of Pentacles, for a lot of y'all, it's some sort of money that's being dropped in your lap. This could be like an inheritance. Um, it's something, a gift. It's something huge that's coming in for you guys this week. The Hermit card, okay, with the Moon card. A lot of hidden energy. Um, this is also wisdom. The Hermit is very wise. A Virgo could be significant. Um, or you're find, you're unlocking something or finding the hack in something that's going to bring you in a lot of money. A lot of money, a lot of happiness, a lot of stability. It's like you're figuring something out. Some of y'all are studying something, okay? Um, or you're like, you're doing research on something here with this hermit card and the moon card here. You're trying to figure something out. You could, It's like cracking the code to something here. Um, and it's just unlocking. It's just unleashing, all right? So let's see. You got the king of swords with the five of pentacles, Okay. And I feel like the, this has been heavy on your mind. Like you've been trying to figure out something. It's something you've been trying to figure out. I don't know what it is in, in regards to who. I don't know if this is work. 
relationship, money, whatever it is you've been like stuck on trying to dig yourself out of this hole. Okay. Maybe it's money issues or trying to figure something out. You, something's been on your mind with this King of Swords and this Five of Pentacles. Okay. Um, but you're moving forward. Page of Pentacles with the star card here. It's like a new start. Something about a child could be very significant. Okay. A Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn child here. Okay, or like a baby is also what I'm getting with this moon and this sun and this star. Okay, maybe it's a child, a hidden child, somebody's pregnant. Okay, um, but it's like someone, someone that you know is pregnant and maybe they've been hiding it and now they are revealing it this week. Okay, or maybe this is you, okay? Or maybe it has nothing to do with the literal pregnancy, but I am picking up on that energy. We got the five of swords here. Yeah, so it's almost like you or somebody else has been fighting to keep something hidden or secret, but it, it feels like it's being revealed or you've been trying to figure something out and whatever it is, you're figuring it out, but you have no idea. King of wands, ace of wands, okay? Five of cups. Six of Cups, Page of Swords. Hmm. It's also the energy of just kind of like not like being on guard and maybe not trusting somebody to fire signs. Okay. Queen of Swords. I don't know. Y'all got to let me know in the comment section how this resonates for you. Okay, so I'm going to leave it here. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel, and I will see you guys next time.